All right, guys, so for the first workout, we're gonna be starting off with some barbell squats, and we will be supersetting them with the second workout. So what we're gonna do here is we're grabbing our 10 rep max, but we're only gonna do eight reps. And on the eighth rep, we're gonna hold it at the bottom to get some isolation action going. And we hold it for as long as we can. So basically till failure. And after you do that, without any rest, you proceed into the next workout, which you will see very shortly. All right, guys, so for the second workout of our superset, we're gonna be doing single-legged bench lunges. So for this exercise, we're just gonna set our foot up on the bench, as you can obviously see, and we just drop down. We gotta keep our, make sure to keep your back straight, keep your traps engaged, you know, just posture overall. But you wanna grab an appropriate way for 10 reps, 10 to five reps, depending on if you're going for hypertrophy or strength. Preferably five though, I mean 10. All right, so after you're done supersetting the, with the pre-exhaust, now we're gonna do back lunges, five by five or five by 10. It's always your preference, but I'm doing five by 10, so 20 in total. And it's basically almost the same thing as the last workout. We're just not isolating, we're compounding, you know, the whole body, our whole movement. You know, just make sure you keep your core engaged and keep your posture, you know, don't round your back basically and you'll be fine. All right guys, so after you finish that workout, you're gonna wanna go get a barbell and do some hip thrusters with it pick an appropriate weight whether you want to do five by five or five by ten always your preference but me i'm doing five by ten in this video and um personally i really like doing isolation holds because i like to feel the engagement in my glutes and as you can see i'm holding the weight up I will be holding it there for 10 seconds and then I'm going to be lowering it down very slowly for another 10 seconds. And it's really just, it's really like just a good workout overall. I'm going to lift it back up another 10 seconds and then I'm going to hold it up there for five seconds. And it's really just, I mean, yeah, just do it. Make sure your lats are a little bit above the bench, like right where your lats finish so you can get good engagement in your glutes all right guys so i decided to give y'all a bonus workout because i love y'all and i want to put y'all on game so for this workout i'm rowing working my overall back getting good engagement with that and after i row the weight I proceed to cling the weight up or hand cling the weight up, whatever you want to call it. And then I get into a squat position and then I press the weight up, working my triceps and shoulders. So I'm basically doing a push pull legs all in one workout. It's really good for strength training, overall stamina training, endurance training. And, you know, it might be hard to get it, at least that part where you snatch the weight up. But overall, if you just learn the movement, learn the technique, it's definitely a, a killer. And I recommend it to anybody, whether you're an athlete or just barely starting out. But, yeah, guys, um, I know I've been slacking lately, but, you know, it's I want to stop that officially. So... Thank y'all for watching. I love y'all. And um, yeah, I'll see y'all 
in the next video which will be coming out in the next day or so so yeah thanks again for watching guys enough slacking i slacked for like the past three months so thanks love y'all